I'm Bill DeFoy out here at Summerfest. Dr. Trudy Ariaga joins us now. Uh, and Dr. Ariaga Tuttle, uh, tell us about Summerfest. Well, this is the 10th annual Summerfest. It's a, uh, an event that is Ventura Education Partnership and Ventura Unifieds uh, in alliance with the city of Ventura. And it's a kickoff to a healthy summer. Excellent. Now, rumor has it that you're retiring. Oh, is that what they say? That's what they say. Tell <laughs> us about what's going on. I am retiring. This is my 14th year as superintendent and uh, time for some transitions and i um, going to miss this. I would imagine now, I mention this to you every time that we are together, but you and I are both out of Ventura High School. I was class of 71. I was 73. Right behind me. That's so right. When I was a senior, you were um, a sophomore. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so, well, anyway, uh, big, big doings out here. This is, like you say, the 10th annual, and it's really a, a great kickoff for the summer. It's a great kickoff. I think we've had about 8,000 people walk through the door, and it's an opportunity for families to come to a free event that is just filled with activity and fun, but also a lot of good information about health and wellness. So, I know that you probably can't define it in one or two sentences, but perhaps you can give us an idea as you look over the time that you have spent as the superintendent, what have been some of the highlights for you? Well, I guess Summerfest is, is uh, what Summerfest represents to me is a highlight of the past 14 years, and that is our commitment to a really healthy school culture, a healthy district culture, uh, one that we care about each other deeply, both socially, emotionally, as well as is in a physical way of health. So I'm very proud of the culture that we've created and the incredible, incredible place that we've created for children to learn and grow. And for your, as you look back, what are some of the things that have brought, besides Summerfest, some personal satisfaction to you? Oh gosh, I, I can't even begin to begin to describe the satisfaction, but I think the, the satisfaction I receive when I watch students perform, whether they're on a basketball court or a drama production or a music program, or a little first grader getting up in front of his or her family for the first time. That brings me tremendous satisfaction just to see our children in their element and being surrounded by a loving community. How do you feel the course of education has changed over the course of years? Education has changed dramatically, you know, as we prepare our children for the world in which they're going to enter. Uh, from the infusion of technology to most recently Common Core, uh, but very definitely just absolutely making sure that our children are equipped to uh, enter the world that is complex and global. And uh, uh, it's, it's been a, a tremendous change, but a, but a great change. Well, Dr. Trudy, I, I wish you the best as you uh, head off into the retirement. And you're certainly not going to ride off into the sunset, that's for sure. No, that's for sure. But thank you so much. It's been a privilege and an honor. All right. Thank you so much. I'm Bill DeFoy with the Heritage Media Group.